And I'm I'm being honest because I told y'all this this weight loss is gonna be raw and uncut, and I and I promised that, like I promised that I would be honest because this is real life. Like this not I'm not just doing this for views. I'm not just doing this to like put on some facade or like make it seem like oh I'm just accomplishing these goals. Like no, nah, this is real life. Like I'm really dealing with this stuff. Like I'm really out here struggling with overeating and like my bad habits. Like. I'm really struggling. to this video because I started a video earlier and I tend to like make a video or record a video and then like things won't necessarily go how I say they'll go in the video so I just didn't even feel like adding that video into this one because I know there's gonna be another day where I go out and do what I was talking about in that video but today is one of those days where i'm like i'm not gonna say down but i'm just not up so i came to the gym and i was pressed to come to the gym all day like all day all day but now that i'm here i don't want to be here and usually i'll come to the gym and i'll feel enthused and all that but i'm not gonna lie i've been feeling my best today and like it's just been a lot like i low-key been eating all day i was trying to show y'all how like at the beginning of the day i was eating a lunchable and i had ate a lunchable but then i ate another lunchable so i ate about three lunchables today and i also went and got mcdonald's today i'm not no mcdonald's eater at all like i stopped eating mcdonald's a long time ago but i had it yesterday i had like a chicken wrap so i was craving it today and y'all know what happens when you eat something and then like you just start to crave it after a while and i'm just like so disappointed in myself because i just did the detox last week and i'm like now i'm back doing stupid stuff and it's like i don't know i'm just disappointed and i'm not saying this so that y'all can sympathize for me because I don't want y'all to sympathize because I'm not sympathizing for myself like I said I'm disappointed but it's just I don't know I'm not feeling it like I ate the McDonald's earlier I had a McChicken and a McDouble I had a few I had a few chicken nuggets some fries like then came home right before the gym I had another lunchable I oh, woke okay. up two two lunchables earlier than one after that like I'm just I don't know. I, I'm i gonna start meal prepping. 
I've already gotten the food for it. I think this is why I'm struggling this hard because I didn't start it when I thought I was going to start it. Like, I thought I was going to start my meal prepping Sunday. I didn't even come home on Sunday. Like, I was out with my friend. Oh, I didn't even tell y'all. So I went to the apple orchard with Tambari on Sunday. And before I even went, I was like, all right, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get a donut. And I was going to be fine if I ate one donut, but I ate like three. Then I had apple cider. And then I ate some more donuts the next day because I got the, the dozen instead of the half a dozen. So I just, I've been on a terrible streak. Like last week was so fulfilling for me. And then this week has just been, like I hit 350, bro. 350 pounds. I hit 350 and I gained, like I looked at my weight the other day after I ate them donuts. I was 363. And I'm I'm being honest because I told y'all this this weight loss is gonna be raw and uncut and I and I promised that. Like I promised that I would be honest because this is real life. Like this not I'm not just doing this for views. I'm not just doing this to like put on some facade or like make it seem like oh I'm just accomplishing these goals. Like no, nah, this is real life. Like I'm really dealing with this stuff. Like I'm really out here struggling with overeating and like my bad habits, like I'm really struggling and I promise you like I'm gonna overcome it and I know I'm gonna overcome it but I just it's just it's been hard and it's just discipline is not easy I feel like I feel like I make I just this is such a I, I'm lost for words like I, I can't even talk this is how appalled I am right now. Like, I'm literally sitting in the sauna right now because I I can't find it in me to work out. Like, I can't find it in me to work out. And I want to go home so bad, but I'm probably going to go run after I get out of here. Just just because I'm around for, like, I don't know. I'm, a, I'm, I'm not going to say I'm going to run, like, the whole time because I'm not going to do that. But I'm going to get on the treadmill. After I come out of here, I'm going to get on the treadmill, and I'm going to definitely run. And I just I just wanted to be honest, and I wanted to be transparent about what's been going on recently. And then today, I'm not going to lie, my mood's kind of down right now because one of my files corrupted from yesterday's video. And so my vlog wasn't trying to go up. And then Crunch Fitness, they have, like, their music on the last. So it's not like you can, you can't hear me in some of the clips and then, like, the clips where I want you guys to hear me, it's just annoying because their music is so loud. Like, I don't know what clip is copywriting my video, but I just, I don't know. I don't know. At this point, I might not even switch to this gym. I might not. I might have to go back to what I know. But that just could be just me talking right now. That just could be me talking. I could just be very disappointed in myself, and I could be making very rational decisions. But I'm not going to ramble no more, man. I just wanted to come on here and just to be honest. And tomorrow, I'm going to vlog from literally the morning to night. So you guys are going to see my entire day. You guys are going to see every decision that I make because... That way, I'll feel like I'm being held accountable. If I feel like a camera's on me, I won't feel the urge to go to McDonald's or feel the urge to just backtrack in general. Like, I won't feel the urge. I mean, not necessarily feel the urge. Like, I'll probably still feel the urge, but I won't follow through with these terrible decisions. So, that's what I'm going to do, man. That's all for this video. Unless I decide to add in a clip right here of me running. But um, I'm going to see you guys in my next video tomorrow. Stay encouraged. 
don't allow these temporary things to get in the way of permanent things things that you want permanent i want this weight loss to be as permanent as possible i'm not trying to lose 50 pounds and gain it right back that's not happening like i'm not seeing 360 on the scale after two days ago matter of fact this morning i think i weighed myself today i'm not sure but i'm not i'm not seeing 360 again like it's not happening i'm never gonna see that number again i'm about to see 330 by my birthday mark my words 339 i'm gonna see 339 by november 7th and i'm gonna vlog it because i can't this is no this is a no-go this is a no-go but yeah i'm gonna see you guys my phone's overheating so Bye.